Hey everyone, this is Daniela Pardo. So recovery efforts for the tow truck operation just wrapped up for the day and I have Officer Michael Bradley with CHP to explain what happened today and what the hope is for tomorrow. Well, we had three divers go in the water starting about 7.30 this morning. Uh, they were able to make significant progress in securing uh, tie downs to hopefully recover the vehicle tomorrow morning. Um, being in the water in the dark that long and making that type of progress is significant. They had to raise the, the bed of the tow truck out of the silt to get secure hookups. So it, look, it appears that they've made that type of progress where they feel confident that they can raise the tow truck uh, tomorrow morning. So it's mostly hooked up. It's hooked up for the most part and then tomorrow will it consist of pulling it out? Yeah, tomorrow, um, I don't know, have all the details on exactly what they need to do, but there's got to be some type of suction with the water flowing through the truck. So they've got to hook up a couple lines or something that causes reverse pressure. I'm not sure how exactly how that works, uh, just to make sure that there's an even flow and the barge stays stable. Is it possible that this operation, this recovery effort can go past tomorrow or are you pretty confident well, it can be tomorrow? Well, we're, they're fairly confident that it, can, that it will be tomorrow. Uh, the dive team has spent significant time under underwater securing that vehicle. But you never know what happens when the vehicle starts to move. It, it doesn't move towards the gas line or something may, you know, that they couldn't see could possibly go wrong. So it's going to be a slow but steady recovery. It's 38 feet that they have to raise that vehicle. So in that time frame, we had to make sure all the underwater gas lines, everything maintain their integrity and that the, hopefully the tow truck maintains its integrity uh, still to safely pull it up. And you're mentioning recovery efforts are continuing at 6 a.m. tomorrow? Right, tomorrow morning they will have a safety briefing, uh, go over what, ne what needs to be done, uh, get everybody on the barge, uh, the divers suited up, get them in the water, get the vehicle hooked up and make the final preparations and give it a go and let's pull that truck out of the water. Yeah, Officer Bradley, thank you. You're welcome. It's been a long day. See you tomorrow. I'll be here. All right, so that's the very latest update from CHP and we will have a live report coming up at 4.30 on ABC 10, where we hear from just people who were out here all day, not just today, but several days. Uh, a lot of people just want closure, of course, the family. Uh, I just spoke to the, Shal the Sharma's son, who uh, is very hopeful that this will happen tomorrow. So I'll see you all at 4.30 on ABC 10.